Hello Maxon here, welcome to the 46th video of my E4 Sweden Let's Play. Uh, so during the last video I made peace with the Mi'kmaq and their ally who were the Mohican. Uh, that province which was the Mohicans is now part of New Sweden. And I didn't annex the Mi'kmaq because you can't annex them both at the same time. Uh, one problem which has arisen since then though is that they are now a protectorate of Vinland and I'm pretty sure that this isn't supposed to happen, a colonial nation making protectorates. So this could uh, definitely cause issues in the future. Uh, this is still 1.4.1 patch. Also in the last video I actually got lucky and uh, this province defected to me. They were a Protestant province of uh, the Castilian West Indies. And also I've got an alliance with Castile now. They just uh, made peace with uh, France, so they're not at war with anyone. Oh, actually they are, Siena and Pisa. Uh, so it looks like they're expanding over in Italy, perhaps. Uh, England's now a rival, so I'm probably going to get Castile to help me in a war against them uh, in the coming future. Uh, next war is probably Denmark, maybe. The last of the Danish provinces. Uh, so I'm actually... I'm uh, going to increase my fleet a bit here. Uh, I could do with a few more transport ships, I think. Uh, so I'm going to make some of those now. Uh, right, so I'm going to make five more of these. Uh, where do I want them? Uh, do them up here, actually. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, my army size is going to roughly be around 20-ish. I'm thinking of maybe declaring war on the Mayans or the Aztec. Uh, if I took enough territory off both of these, they could form a colonial nation. I should probably do that before Spain or England does it. Uh, right, so I think I've done everything I want to do, so I'm going to pause. Uh, right, so claim fabricated on Sealand. So I've now got a cast spell against Denmark. Uh, I'm thinking about declaring more on Burgundy as well. They've embargoed me recently. What I would quite like to happen is that they annex the Netherlands. And then I could conquer some of their territory and release the Netherlands perhaps as a vassal. That could be a good idea. Uh, they have a lot of cores so they'd be, and claims they'd be a very good vassal. Uh, I thought they'd have more cores than that actually. Maybe they've had them forced uh, to release them or something at some point. Uh, right, so excellent year, extra manpower. Diplomat arrived back from uh, Denmark. Uh, relations are good there. Uh, right, Pomerania, I'll send this to. Proof relations there. Uh, right. So, money's. I'm building up money for various things. So There's probably a couple of unique buildings I can make now. I've uh, got Diplomat back from Castile. Uh, I'm going to send this to Lithuania. Lithuania embargo me, I wish they weren't to be honest. Oh, that reminds me actually. Uh, trade. Uh, this isn't probably needed here. No one's getting trade out this side, so uh, my own colonial nations are doing the work here. So I'm going to recall that merchant. And to be honest, there's not an awful lot of good places to stick it. Uh, they're all going up to my trade nodes. It's a tiny bit not going there. That's all going up there. There are three nations collecting trade there. So I'm probably going to stick it back in Europe in the Krakow node. They've got a bit of power there. But I'll figure that out in a bit. Uh, so what's this? Oh, uh, transport ships just got over here. Uh, right, so I'm trying to figure out how many troops do I have in a new world. Uh, Two, two of three and cav. Right, I need to grab those in a second. Uh, that can move to there. Uh, there's enough cav there. So I've got all the calves I need. Probably got one more cannon that I want over here at the moment. Uh, Alright, so I'm going to grab uh, these. Where am I colonizing? Uh, probably not going to stick any troops there. I don't think I need any. What about here? I will... Maybe there, actually. Um, 
right, so watch there. Once these uh, new cogs are coming, I might start to think about attacking the mines actually. Right, so let's just turmoil. Oh, Emperor being a pain again. Lunaburg. Definitely need to go to war against Austria at some stage. Um, right, so we're going to do that one. So it's up to that much. I'm thinking about removing territory from the Empire if he's going to be doing this all the time. Um, yeah, you know what? I will. Right, so... Which territories I want to remove? Holstein. Uh, right. That's no longer Emperor territory. Uh, probably that probably gives him a Cassis belly. I'm not 100% sure. It gives me. I think it gives you minus 50 for each province you do. So I'm only going to do one at this point. Uh, that's going to take a uh, 25 years ish to get rid of. If he keeps on doing that event, though, I should make use of. Um, I'll take a uh, territory out whenever he does that, I think. Uh, right. I have one there. Right, so there's no decent missions at the moment. Uh, no. Okay, so Diplomat is back from Lithuania. I'll send... Uh, where am I sending this to? Uh, not there. But England. I'll send it to England. My agent was scavered. It's got low relations, but it doesn't really matter too much. Brandenburg just collapsed. They had pretender rebels, I think. Okay. Never lost any territory. Oh, that reminds me, actually. Um, I. I think I've got admin 12 now, haven't I? Yeah, I should probably change my government type. So this one is national manpower and vassals. This would be tax and production. So I'd be a lot better off with that one, I think. Um, probably should have had this one for a long time. This would have lowered my diplomatic costs and lowered revolt risk at a time when I was having a little revolts. But I'm going to take this one now. Uh, I'll probably get that one when it comes as well. So take that. Whoa, 50. Okay, I did not know that. So maybe I shouldn't do that. If it lowers your legitimacy. I should probably... You should probably change your government type when... Right, what does this do? National revolt risk. Tolerance of true faith. I'm going to hold off on it. If my legitimacy is low for some reason, then I may change, but I don't think it's worthwhile for a bit of extra money. Right, my cogs have uh, come here. Let's put those up. Let me send those across the Atlantic in a bit. Uh, is this done now? Yeah, that's Protestant. I'm going to move those to Holstein, actually. There, they can attach to so there, move to Holstein. Alright. Right. Which there, these can attach. And I think I'll move one infantry over to the excess aggressive, and this one I won't bother with. Right. This Bahamas done yet? Barbados, whatever it is, no. Uh, right, so what's here? Uh, that's all okay. I could probably do with a couple more infantry and a couple more, a few more cannons. I want over here actually. So I'm gonna bring those to there. Right. there. This, right, so I want three cannons. One, two, three. And I think I'll take the infantry as well. How many do I need? 
Yeah, two infantry. So three cannons, two infantry. Uh, they can attach. Bring myself to there. So this is what my final regiment's gonna be looking like pretty much. Uh, eight four eight. Uh, so that's not good. Aragon allied to England. Um, probably won't prevent me from declaring war on them in future though. Right, so I take a cav out and the infantry out. Go over there. As soon as England's army's down or their navy's down, then I'm going to go after them. They're at war with uh, France at the moment. So where are they? England's... It's easier to just do this, I think. Uh, England's... Yeah, they haven't lost any troops yet. In fact, their manpower seems to be going up. So France is in a bit of trouble at the moment. Uh, right, so they can group up. And they can go there. So how many units have I got? I need five more infantry and a cannon to bring back from the Caribbean, I think. Right, the Faroe Islands just caught up. Uh, There. Right, these can come back up to there. Probably going to bring a whole regiment of 20 over to the Mayans in a bit. Uh, once I figure out my stacks in the new world. And over here. Merchant return from the Caribbean. Right, let's check. See all the trades flowing in the right direction. They're still doing that. Hands is down there as well. That doesn't need help. That doesn't need help. Notice that. Notice that. Uh, collect in here and here. Automatically collect in there. So I think I'm going to put it in crack off or try it here. Um, transfer trade power. So I'm fourth in crack off even though I don't have any territory here. Um, that's already been done for me. Or Swedish power like this. Crap, anyway. Um, power in any of these? No. So, how am I getting so much power here? From provinces. Oh, wrong one. Uh, it's trade from other nations. Is it? Oh, downstream. That's where I'm getting it from. Right, so, uh, transfer trade power here. 21 days, and should be going on that one. Diplomat arrived back from England. I'll stick you. Looks like Austria starting to be at France. Yeah, France has probably had it in this game now. Um, it's not really. A, I think I'll improve relations to Hungary, actually. They're definitely a potential alliance later on against um, Austria. Have enough uh, diplomatic slots. I can annex these in 68 or something like that. Check in a few years. Okay, so I can claim against England. Oops. Uh, six, three, four. What do I need over here then? I need um, five and one. Five, zero, one. Okay, it's so one, two, three, four, five. Cannon. Attach up there. These can bring back over to here. Probably bring in this whole regiment back over in a minute, so maybe I shouldn't should just bring them over and well, I'll, I'll do that. Uh, right, so right, so, so okay. oh, Lubeck not Lubeck, crack off 0.48. I think that did next to nothing actually so I'm not sure there's much use there actually um, but to be honest, I don't know where to put it Everything's working fine. Could put it here, maybe? Don't have any power, though. Um, 
That's automatic. I'll just leave it there. Okay, so Diplomat is back from England. Let's send that to... Uh, I probably want to keep the Casas Valley on Burgundy, the embargo, so I'm not going to send it there. Um, it's Poland like. Send it to Poland. Relations. Uh, I could maybe. Uh, could maybe support rebels in England potentially because they've got a bit of island. Not sure. Right, so we've uh, colonized Havana. Right, I've got one colony almost done there. So, I'm not sure which one's next. Maybe here. Um. Or there. Right. right, so Diplomat is back from Pomerania. I'm going to send you to uh, Portugal. No, there's not many good ones at all. Ottomans. I wouldn't mind getting an alliance potentially with the Ottomans if they could help me out against Russia potentially long term but um, yeah I'll send one here it's a long way away from getting that not even sure if it's possible alright I'd have to rival Russia and as long as Russia are on good terms I'm probably not going to go after them alright it's a while I'm going to be a long while away from getting a big enough military to take them on uh, so wool is just there New colonial governor in New Sweden. So he's admin power. Okay, looks like someone exploring up there now. Uh, right, so New Sweden. Diplomatic quality is 10 admin. I probably, I don't think they've called everything yet, have they? So I probably still want to keep the admin guy. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep this up even though the Liberty Desire will go up. Okay. So what's that up to? 15, it's not much at all. Unless it hadn't gone up quite yet. Uh, looks like... Brittany made peace of England. Right, that's probably separate to the war against France. Uh, I thought maybe Britain is on the same side as England. Maybe I read that wrong. I'm not sure. Right, so Diplomat is back from Poland. Still no idea where I'm sending that to. What about Russia? Yeah, why not? In the beta patches, you can leave a Diplomat in a place which is useful. Um, so, oh, right, my feet are back here. Group those up. Probably with the next diplomatic power, I should just get that actually. So I can build some proper ships. Uh, I've said that, it would uh, could reduce the time if I get that. Um, yeah, I think I want to be prepared to go to war against England though, so. Uh, let's get this next. So 414. Take that now. So Carracks and Caravels are now available. Flight will come in next time. Uh, right, so this army can go to there. Probably going to be declaring war on the Mayans actually in a bit. Uh, so let's make some ships. Uh, right, this is going to take a while, so I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I've built 10 of the new Carrack Heavy ships. So this is a fleet which may be able to help out against England in the future. And I've also built a regimental camp as well, I think it was, in uh, Lüneburg. Oh, not Lüneburg, Mecklenburg. Right, so uh, I'm going to pause again. Uh, conversion successful in Holstein. Uh, so where am I going to send this to? 
Uh, missionary Vibog, actually. Yeah, I'll send it there. Oh, wow. So that's actually converted over to Protestantism. There's an extra chance of that happening because I converted my provinces along the border. So hopefully Navy will as well. That would be great. Uh, could uh, flip to me, potentially. If Russia has a ton of problems. Highly unlikely, but you never know. Uh, actually, I'm sh going to uh, disband my early cat here as well. I don't need that anymore. Uh, right, so that can expand it. It's an old design. Uh, and I've got a minus to shipbuilding time from the vents. So that's going to come in handy. Uh, right, tons of things happened then. Lost the claim on pots. Then I'm going to have to do that. That's run out. Uh, lost the claim that on Cassus Belly. Right, Swedish West Indies has been formed because of um, the Bahamas. Right, excellent. Uh, I'm going to do that in a second. Need to get a diplomat back. I'll get it back from uh, there. Uh, Baffin Bay, someone exploring up there. So, core, 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 core. I'm happy with the name there. Okay, so Swedish West Indies. Uh, my third colonial nation. Uh, no troops yet. Taxes 13%. No tariffs. Uh, so, could potentially. Oh, well, that's okay. Uh, so that would become part of it as well in a bit. Uh, what am I forgetting now? Right, diplomat for the claim. And not sure which one was done then. This one wasn't it? Probably. Right, I need to go and get. Oh, all my um, cogs are over in Europe, so I need to wait on those. Uh, so do I get a settler back in a day? No, I don't. So I need to get a settler back from somewhere. Um, I'm actually going to take the one from Havana. I'll call that. Right, and let's wait a day. Right, so settlers back. Money's. How's money doing? Up to 60 now. Amazing. Um, so, next colony. What do I have on the go at the moment? I think I'll come down here, try and stop the English from getting more. So, which one? That one? Uh, is that too far away? Maybe. Uh, where did they? Yeah, it is too far away, actually. I'll do it. Oh, Panama. Are any of these have special things? Doesn't look like it. Not sure why that's so distant, actually. Probably... Well, I have no idea, actually. Right, so I'll send that to here. Hopefully England can't colonise it. Uh, right. Put timer up. It's reached uh, Festa Gotland. I need to get a diplomat. Right, the Russian one's nearly done, actually. Uh, this army can... These are all transports now, which is a potential issue. Um... How long are these going to take? I think I might wait for my heavy ship fleet to get done and then declare one of my ends, actually. Uh, so, this fleet can come back over to... Um, no, I'll bring them over now. Uh, attach them. These can come over to... Uh, here, Abenaki. And this army can move up to. Um, nah, they can stay there. Fireborg's got rebellion issues, so I probably could do with a force over there, actually. Um, right, you know what? I'll put that in there. This army can go over to Vyborg. I'll bring the other army from Holstein over. Right. Makes more sense. England sporting the independence of East Frisia. Can vassals declare independence on their own? I 
but it can. I didn't know that. I thought it was just personal union and criminal nations. Ouch. Peasants are going to lose that. How is that so much? I don't know. Yeah, they're dead. Uh, two infantry and a cannon. I have to replace Richard Holstein. And these can move over to um, Acadia. Right. England enters the military alliance of Brittany. Battle of Bahamas. Yeah, wiped out. I have to bring an army down here in a bit. Uh, right, so what was that? Two infantry and a cannon, wasn't it? Right, so I'm going to have to make those back home. Uh, right, so good regiment, cannon, infantry, infantry. My three main military uh, provinces. So diplomat arrived back from Ottomans. Oh, uh, claim on Brandenburg. Okay, claim. Could potentially get these in a vassalization. Might not be such a bad idea. Right, Potsdam. It's going to be hard to get into a war against them. Uh, trade arrives. Diplomat from Russia's back. Actually, I think also maintenance on maximum. Oh, all the way over. So I was thinking to get a diplomat guy. Um, left to wait. Fur in Penacook. Uh, so I'll stick this. I'll keep a diplomat on hand. Uh, once a fleet done, still a while. Right, I'm gonna stick my maintenance on. Now I'll leave it off for a bit. Right, so spread discoveries, Belize, Magdeburg, Brooklyn, Alliance of Hansa. That might be good. Uh, Viber, good. Okay, Emperor just initiated initiated a reform, the first one actually. Still 38 princes, so there's a lot of the empire left. Uh, tariffs on naval supplies. Um, five extra five liberty desire doesn't seem worth it for one tariff value, to be honest. Probably prefer. This maybe. Right, so okay. Got extra military. Which is Acadia. Right, gotta stick my maintenance on. And they can attach when those of here, this is a bit overkill probably. Uh, actually, I should stick the Conquistador on uh, there. I can't. Right. Attach. Bring this over to here. Right. For marriage, no. Uh, stick, I'll leave the units there, though they're well positioned to take on the Mayans in a bit. Uh, right. Okay, which coast of Florida? Uh, did they morale up yet? Yeah, not really, I'll wait another month and then attack. What's this? Colonial Ventures. Diplomatic technology cost. How long for? Wish I had this earlier. Ten years. Um, that's a bit of a pain, actually, because I wouldn't mind building. Light. Uh, I need to build a ton of light ships as well. 
So they're going to cost more money. Um, but I do want to upgrade to level 9 in a bit, perhaps. Because I get the new flights. Um, yeah, I guess the ships will have to be more expensive. Right. Uh, okay, level 3 artist. Right, let's attack over here then. Um, Wurzburg, Alita, Brennerburg again. Right, minus two for the crossing, but wipe them out. Uh, right, I've got a ton of new heavy ships. So let's group all these up. Let's uh, go down to there. Holland, Holland. I think that's nearly all of them. All of them. Right. Okay. Just a best Scotland, Holland, Holland. I need to get some transports to grab those as well in a bit. Um, group up. Is that eight? Right, two more come in. Right, excellent. Bring these over to uh, new, new World. Uh, come down to here. Uh, I'll keep my maintenance on just in case they're attacked. Uh, should be enough supply there. Yeah. Right, these can come and grab those troops. Actually, I'll leave them here. Right. Uh, okay. Uh, it's probably been about half an hour ish now as well. Uh, so, in the next video, uh, I'm going to, as soon as this is done, I'll uh, attack the Mayans, I think. And we're we'll probably. I'm only a, near to able to attack Denmark again as well, uh, March of next year. Okay, so uh, thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time.